morning. I just want to say um, my thoughts go out to everybody in Berlin um, and Germany as a whole for the shocking act of terrorism that happened yesterday at one of their German markets. Um, it, it's sad to see that even at this time of year there are cowards and morons out there that think it's alright to take somebody's life in the way that it has. Um, my personal thoughts are that no matter what has happened, the best thing Germany can do is carry on regardless, stick their fingers up to the terrorisms, to the terrorists even, and tell them to fuck off and show them that they won't win. Um, yeah, just a, an absolute shocking thing to see happen so close to Christmas. Um, yeah. So yeah, it's half eight on Monday night. Um, just quickly, I want to say a massive thank you to everybody that's been viewing my channel. Obviously, as you can see, I've had nearly 1,600 views in three months. So yeah, just want to say a massive thanks. And hopefully, I'm going to try and push that and get that to 2,000 views by New Year's Eve. So I can start 2017 with a big bang. So yeah, thanks again. On with Tuesday's vlog. First call done. Um, was just a, a reference issue on a document handler. So, previous engineer that been out hadn't seen the contact because she wasn't in work. Um, she wasn't sure if the machine had been fixed, so just re-logged the call. So I just had to come out and explain to her that the machine had already been repaired once by an engineer. So yeah, it's off to Pro VQ now to go and um, mess about on one of their new machines. So yeah, that'll be good. So yeah, that's my calls done. Um, just got home just gonna have some lunch then pick up Charlotte from her nans uh, she's got a hair appointment tonight and then it's Zumba so but while I've got you I want to talk about something quite important um, to do with football um, my opinion on what FIFA's done so I'll get sorted out and then I'll talk to you about that so yeah, FIFA, in their infinite wisdom, have decided to fine the home nations, so that's England, Scotland, Wales and Ireland, for wearing poppies um, on Remembrance Sunday, um, of which England have been fined the biggest amount. I think this is wrong. I've said it in previous videos that the poppy is a sign of remembrance, not an actual um, uh, terrorist organisation or, you know, like the English Border Force or anything like that. It's got fuck all to do with that. It's a mark of remembrance for soldiers that were lost in the war. I think FIFA have been massively off point with this and are trying to cover their collective asses because they employed numpties like Seb Blatter in the past that would take backhanders and bungs. So now they're trying to run by the letter of the law instead of using their noggins and using a bit of common sense. I believe now that England, we're pretty rubbish as a home nation at the moment anyway, so it shouldn't make that much of a difference to us. Should actually um, not play in the World Cup, possibly. You know, actually stay as a united force possibly refuse to pay the fines um, because at the end of that if we pay the fines we're just agreeing 
that we shouldn't have wore the poppies, which is bollocks. So yeah, if I was the English FA, or the Scottish FA, or the Welsh, or the Irish FA, I'd refuse to pay the fines and see what FIFA done about us then. You know, you can't you can't let people like this win. You know, at the end of the day, they've dropped the bollock in the past. Let people take backhanders. It's took years for the football corruption to be sorted out, and I still don't believe it's sorted out now. But yeah, just an absolute joke. And FIFA should be ashamed. I'm gonna have to leave it there because my phone's just started ringing. So, you know, I said yesterday that I uh, played my final round of golf for 2016. Um, and I also mentioned it on Saturday. I forgot to say yesterday, thanks to Dave, Sophie and Sue for playing with me. We had a really good day. I actually played all right golf, played to my handicap, which is the first time I've done that since probably the middle of October. So really happy with that. Like I say, I've now got three weeks off, so I'm not supposed to be playing until the 14th of January. But I think on New Year's Eve, Jodie's taken her nan out for lunch for her birthday. So I might be able to sneak in, uh, possibly around on the Saturday knock if it's on. So stay tuned. Might be able to, not too sure. As for the rest of today, I am currently not in any sunlight. I am going to pick Charlotte up. In a bit, she's got hair appointment at six o'clock. Uh, and then I think they're going to Zumba. So I might get the putting mat out and just make sure, you know, try and do a bit of putting. Make sure the game stays all right for the time that I'm going to be having off over Christmas. My arm is now aching. So yeah, just going to fetch Charlotte now. Uh, I'm probably going to end the vlog here because I thought of another video that I want to record today um, and hopefully get on YouTube some point later this week um, regarding uh, the Vice Golf Balls that I currently use and uh, do a bit of a my feeling comparison between them and the other balls that I've used a little bit over the last few weeks, which is the Strixon AD333. Um, so, like I say, I want to get that up tonight, so I'm probably going to end the vlog here for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on all my other social media platforms. Uh, the links are in the description down below. And I'll see you tomorrow.